Hello guys, how you doing? Welcome back to Sim UK, and of course, welcome back to Airport CEO. I'm feeling a lot better today. You can still hear it in my voice. I'm still getting over this cold. It hasn't quite fully, fully gone, but um, it's nice to be back. I took a couple of days out just to try and get it out of my system, and we're almost there. We're almost there. Things have definitely expanded at the airport. I mean, look at this. We've got two medium... Uh, parking spots, we've got a police station, a fire station. Everything we need is pretty much here. Um, but we've got some problems as well, haven't we? We've got some issues. Did I build the ATC in the last episode? I forget. Or are we researching it? Operations... As your airport's needs increase, so does the governmental requirements. An extended commercial license gives you the right to schedule more flights per day and build a large ATCT. So that's the problem, is I can't fit any more flights in because um, we've reached our maximum limit of 25. I don't suppose putting a second ATC over here would help, so I won't bother. It looks like uh, we're just going to have to wait for this to go through. We're at 20%. Hopefully we'll get there. Let's have a look at the schedules that we've got so far. We've got some gaps in here, look. Oh, hello. Passengers have started to complain that they have to carry their baggage all the way to the aircraft. This is obviously not very efficient and greatly annoys your passengers. It's time to design a conveyor belt system so we can transport baggage to and from the aircraft using baggage trucks. To get a working baggage system up and running, it's important to set it up properly. Continue with the next checklist to get started. So we've got to complete the R&D project baggage handling. Well, that's going to have to wait because I need to increase our ATC limits first. We're going to start having problems. I can see we got a couple of medium-sized jets in there. I think the first one's coming on Sunday, right? Yeah. So the first medium-sized jets will be here on Sunday. So hopefully we'll have the uh, ATC built before then so that we can expand a little bit more. So I was sort of contemplating moving these taxi things, wasn't I? How much money have we got? Not much, actually. 784,000 and we've got a massive debt as well, haven't we? One point eight million to pay back. Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. Okay. So for the time being, what's going on here? I think we can get rid of these guys now. I'll keep our costs down a bit. 8,000 an hour we're losing. But we are very busy. We are ticking over at quite a rate. Is this runway actually operational? Oh, come on, medium and small, you idiot. So all of my planes would be going the other way, down to here. No wonder it's so stacked up. Commercial only. Okay, we're good. We're good. Add approach lights. I think we've already got approach lights, right? We do now. Right, so I'm not sure what we're going to do, really. Uh, I'm going to hit the 20-minute timer. Bump. That's now counting down. Try and keep these videos nice and short, if we can. Um, and just see what I can do. Um, I am very limited, I think, until... Uh... How do you get Project Group 2? How do you unlock that? Because that's what we need. We need to be researching more things, more than one thing at a time. Oh, let me check my vehicles as well. Oh, yeah, good. It says a sign. Oh, 
What do I assign it to? An incident, I guess. Wow, look at that airplane. Either that's had a bird strike, a serious oil leak, or it's some kind of weird design. It's going back to Glasgow. Say flight, buddy, say flight. Yeah, I'm quite I'm quite impressed with what we built so far. I think we need to expand out this way and up the other side, but um Yeah, I'm quite impressed with what we've built so far. Considering we're playing on the second hardest difficulty level, and I haven't played for a long time. I think it's working out quite well. But I am excited to see these jets, I really am. What else can I look at? What can we do? 50%. Uh, how do I unlock this? Can I figure it out? It's got to be in there somewhere, hasn't it? But you can't look at it. You can't look at it whilst you're working on something. International Airport. Build a shop. Oh, look at this, they've got multiple cashiers. That's interesting. Shops and cafes, that's probably a good idea. Can I... Oops. Can I build a shop or a cafe? That would be nice. Shops. Oh no, look. Restaurants and cafes are still locked. Sixty-two out of hundred and twenty sales. Two. Thirteen. Four. So this tiny little shop here is way more successful than any of these other shops by a huge margin and what do they sell i don't know what they sell Oh, it's just like items you need for a flight. Okay. So maybe I could replicate that over here somewhere. That's not a bad idea, is it? Let's, um, let's go building tools, save template. Small but good shop. So I put this small but good shop over here, I think. Smaller than that shop, goodness me. I've got to put a shop marker down first, all right. Why doesn't it save that for me? I mean, it's very similar to this shop, but I think this is a different kind of shop. This is a one star as well. It's an experiment. I'm just trying to generate a bit of cash, that's all, really. Look how many cars we've got parked here now. That's amazing. So, yeah, I was going to move these taxi points and put in some more parking. I think that's not a terrible idea.
not very busy that taxi anyway so I could extend the road out this way and I could put loads more parking in there's loads I could do there's no rush we're not overloaded yet there's still parking spaces you can see and once these get here though that could be a very different kettle of fish how are we getting on please 76.8 oh my god this whole episode is going to be waiting for that to unlock isn't it so we have two security points a large booking desk Yeah, we just have to be patient. I'm not good at being patient. Well, I could finish this off. Let's finish this off. Where's that bush? Is that it? Hedge, rather. There we go. That'll look nice. And in fact, what I might do... Just take a section of that out. There and there. And just finish it off. It's got to be on a sidewalk. Okay. Weird. Very odd, but okay. It does look pretty cool with the water out the front. I do like that. I'm glad I went with that design. How are we getting on? We're almost there! 88.7%. Oh my god. I've got to figure out how to do multiple research. Because this is just killing me. What's going on there? Where are my workers? Here they come. Ninety-three. I love all the lights and the flickers and stuff. They've done a really good job on this game, I've got to say. Just hope I can turn this into a profit-making machine. Ninety six point six and we got ten minutes left, so we got half the episode to do something with it, hopefully. And it looks like we're gonna start doing some baggage and control systems as well. Uh actually over here I've got planning mode. So in planning mode I'm thinking of I was a bit nervous then. I thought that was going to actually build it, but it didn't. So now I can come in here and I can turn off. No, I don't want to turn off tape. Oh, hang on. A buffet table and an information desk. Okay, we're going to have to move all this back. There's no way that that works as is. Um, let me see here. I think we've just unlocked this, right? How do I have multiple projects going on at the same time? A waste depot, look at that. Belt loader. 
a large ATC, 200 flights per day. So I think this is the one I've got to do. So that takes 12 hours for that one. Ah, here we go. That takes eight hours. That will unlock this over here. That will help so much. Right, so if we go now into planning for tomorrow, why do we still not have any? Airlines are super happy with us there. Oh, yeah, okay. I forgot to build the ATC. That was the, the whole point of, <laughs> of doing that. Where is it? There it is. And it's too big for that gap. That looks like a good spot to me. That's going to take a little while, but we will have unlocked the ability to have uh, more aircraft coming in. Just thinking now. Um, there we go. Right. Okay. So I was just thinking, how was I going to do this? I'm going to pop it in there. But the reality is I'm going to have to build a second level and this is going to have to be a bridge so that we can still have cars getting access around here. So that's not going to work as is. But consider that a bit of future proofing. We don't want to get overloaded, of course. How much are these gates? 75,000. Holy moly. Well, I'm going to put one in just so I can see where it goes. I think it's meant to be there, isn't it? get rid of that then? Do I just build over the top of it? Why is the structure not possible? Because that's there. How do I get rid of that? If I go, there we go. Alrighty then. The controls are there. It's just whether or not you remember them. Okay. So that's pretty good. I do feel like this needs to change a bit. Ah, right, let's get a contract. Traveller's shop. Three stars. Excellent. Let's hope that makes a few sales. They're still only halfway there, but um, that's okay. Because when these guys arrive, we're going to have so many more passages, it's going to be unreal. 
How are we getting on here? Why why does it only let three people work on this? I've got nine employees. At least let nine of them go on there. Nearly done though. Very nearly done. Any second now, in fact. Boom. Looks superb. So if we come into the flight session and look at tomorrow, we still don't have any big aircraft till Sunday. CRJ-200. See a CRJ-200. I said that was a medium aircraft, didn't I? Where did that CRJ-200 go? There's a DHC-6 there, which is also known as a twatter or a twin otter. But uh, that doesn't quite qualify as a, as a big aircraft. ATR-72, I'm not sure what that is. So it looks like we don't have enough small stands, to me. Trying to think where I can squeeze in a couple more. This is all our land as well now, isn't it? So we could definitely expand out this way. I reckon I could get one in there. Let's have a look. It will fit. And I don't think it will break that. I think we can squeeze one more in there. So, yes, sorry guys, not the most exciting episode ever, but um, we have, oh look at that, we've nearly completed this, this is going to help us so much. We have um, 45 seconds left of the episode, I guess all I can do is say that, um, you know, roll on Sunday, we should have access to more aircraft. Um, maybe I should sign a contract for some more larger aircraft. But I'll hold off for now because I don't want to rush it or anything. One, two, three, four, five, six. So once this one's in, that'll be seven. And I think that will take the excess that we've currently got. Maybe I need one more. Maybe the police station is going to have to move. That's it, guys. That's 20 minutes up. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, take care. Goodbye for now.